You cannot make this stuff up. Harry just disclosed a mind-boggling information and people don't know, especially Africans, whether we should laugh or be angry. So Prince, well, former Prince, I guess, Harry revealed that him and his brother William once fought over Africa. Who owns Africa or rather who does Africa belong to? Let me show you this clip. We'll come back and discuss. You have this sibling rivalry with your brother mm -hmm. and you, you say that, you know, he, d he didn't want you on his turf. At one point, there's an argument, right, about Africa and charity work. And mm. you say, he said, oh, Africa's my thing. You can't have it. Mm. I mean... So this clip is from ABC's interview with Harry. And as you heard right there, he said, quote, I know that Africa is very special to you, but your brother exerted his power to say, no, that's my place. The elephants, the giraffes are all mine. If somebody that didn't know Africa was a whole continent heard this interview, they would not know, like they won't have an idea that it's a continent like with 54 countries you would think it's like an object that they are fighting over like what i know some people are angry but you know this should not be something that you are going to be angry at like it, it's it's a known fact scramble for africa happened right um and it's not a new phenomenon. I understand when you hear it from the royals themselves maybe when they're admitting it it's quite shocking but you know, what else did you expect? Of course, they're going to see Africa as an object or as, as something that belongs to them. Like that's what we're fighting against. That's what is going on behind the scenes. Even though now it's different, it's not going to be direct colonization and it's more or so neocolonization, it's still here. It's still alive and well. And that's what we've been talking about. It's it's not shocking to most of us. If, if anything, I'm surprised that Harry is talking about this. But then again, Harry has been talking about quite a bit and exposing his family left and right to the point where now people are saying, OK, enough. We're tired of hearing about the royal family now. Let's just stop talking about them. But it seems like, you know, all this time he's been quiet now is when it's like he's getting his revenge. He has a book out and he talks about how he's the spare and how, you know, he was brought into this world in order to be a spare to his brother or something like that. So it, it, it's, it's a weird and bizarre situation they have going on there. But I certainly don't find it shocking that the brothers, William and Harry, were fighting over Africa as if it belongs to them. That's how they act. That's what they've seen their parents, their grandparents, their great, great grandparents do. So that's all they know. But in my opinion, instead of getting angry, we should laugh at this and really show them that it's no longer that way. You know, things have changed and we're not going to accept this nonsense from them or any other nation in the world world. Anyways fam, let us know down below what your thoughts are about what Harry said about him and his brother fighting over who owns Africa basically. I am Ungil Zalalem. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.